Yeah, so we gone. Huh? Stop, we good. Stop, chill. We on. Chill. Scale, huh? let's go. Let's go. Domingo, huh? let's go. Domingo. Tape, huh? let's go. Huh? Set, huh? let's roll. Hey. Straightening, straightening, straightening. Yeah, straightening, straightening, straightening. Don't not get straightened, but straightened. Don't not get straightened, but straightened. Don't not get straightened, but straightened. You don't get shit straight, you don't straighten it. Nah. In this game, sit back, be patient. Gang. Niggas act like gang. the game went crazy. Huh? Niggas act like some been taken. Took what? Ain't nothing but a little bit of straightening. Been kicking shit, popping out daily. Go. On the island, it's a movie I'm making. That's facts. I'm counting the narrows with Robert De Niro. He telling them that you're amazing. Hey. Put that shit on. Shit on. Nigga, get shit on. shit on. I bought two whips and I put my bitch on. Skirt. She put this wrist on. Rich. She fed the wrist said it went rich and mill prongs. Turn up and Hey y'all, good morning. I am trying to hurry up and get ready. I am going to this coffee shop I found on TikTok. It's super cute. Let me try to multitask. <laughs> super cute and I wanted to go. They had like the cutest lattes and matchas and like little chocolates and stuff. So I really wanted to go to just like check it out and see what it's about. Me and Jamima are going and I'm very excited. Originally, I planned on beating my face. Now we're down to trying to just do a quick little one too because it is 11.07. We're meeting at 12.30. Where's my mirror? Oh, so I plan to be at the house. So my plan is to be at the house by 12 because it's in Buckhead and I just don't want to run into no traffic or anything, but I'm just so... Hi, I just took a shower. I just did skincare. I feel like I'm just running around. I feel like I need a second to just decompress. <laughs> like, oh my goodness. None of my fans are charged. Just calm down. But I really wanted to get on here. Once I'm going to give myself five minutes. I'm going to give myself five minutes. Let me get y'all right too. I'm going to give myself five minutes to just decompress and get myself together. And then we're going to come back and talk about yesterday. Because I just want to talk about how I was feeling yesterday and how I'm trying to get myself from out of that. So, give me one second. Yesterday, I'm not sure what was going on with me. And it honestly, this is like, I don't want to say this is like something like, like, I don't, I feel heavy talking about it. I feel like, I don't know, but I was just so anxious yesterday, like thinking about like the future. It was just like... I kept having thoughts of like, oh my God, like what if, what if everything just goes away? What if, cause right now I'm in an era, I feel like I just went through one of my toughest seasons as an adult. I went through a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff. And I felt like I'm just now coming out of that. And I feel like, you know, when you come out of like a tough season, it's just like, whew, I made it like... Thank you, Jesus. It's over. We can move on. Like, let's let's get our life back on track. That's how I felt. And now I feel like I'm in this space where I'm living kind of like a like a my dream life. Like, I'm just I'm, I'm happy. I'm doing things that make me happy. I'm just really happy. And yesterday I was just so anxious. I'm like, oh my god, what if just everything just goes away? Like, what if? What, what if I'm not able to do this? What if I'm not able to do that? And it's like, whoa, slow down. Like, what's happening? Why? And I couldn't figure out, let me, but I couldn't figure out like where all of that was just stemming from because when I tell y'all, it just popped up out the blue, like so random. And I know it was nothing but the devil just trying to play tricks with my mind, trying to confuse me, trying to just get me to worry about things that God then promised me. And that's what I'm, that's that's why I'm going with this conversation. It's just like, I know for a fact, like no matter what I go through, how many tough seasons I go through, God didn't bring me this far to leave me because through everything that I felt like I was going through and I felt like it was never going to look up, it looked up. It, it, it really looked up and I'm good. So I don't understand why I get these feelings of doubt and and anxiousness when I know where my help come from. You know what I mean? Like, I'm just... I just wanted to talk about that because maybe somebody else is dealing with that. You know, just like... Feeling like... I don't know. Like, I yesterday... 
I was just feeling like, oh my God, what if I wake up and everything's gone? Like, I, I have no job anymore. I'm not able to pay my bills anymore. Everything is just gone. It's just like, girl, like, let's be for real. Like, calm down. And like I said, I just feel like that was the devil because I'm so happy right now. I'm so content. I'm so, I'm so just in my own world, doing my own thing. And I just feel like the devil like, hold on now. Why she, why she ain't even, she ain't even like, what's going on? And even, and even like when it comes to like finances, like, don't get me wrong. I'm good. Like I, I'm, I'm more than good. Um. Like, I'm good, but I'm just so used to being like this. Oh, I, I can't, I can't take a minute for me because I gotta, I gotta get to the bag. I gotta get to the bag. Like, my mindset, my, my mentality with money has changed so much. Like, I have definitely chilled on the hustler mentality. Like, don't get me wrong. I, I, I want the money. And I've always been about the money. I always will be. But I've just chilled out so much. Like, like for YouTube, for example. I used to be the type of person like, oh, I made this last month. Okay, we need to double that the next month. And then we need to double that. In this season in my life, I'm like, if I have enough money to pay my bills and live the life I've been living, I'm good. Like, I'm so good. I'm better than good. Because I just, right now, I'm not in that season of just wanting every penny I can get. Because although that's good, but what comes with that is just like so much stress, so much anxiety, so much. And it's just like, I'm not there right now. Like... I'm just not there right now, you know? How about we just go in the kitchen and bake some blueberry muffins? Like, that's just where I'm at in life. Like, and it's so crazy to me because what happened? Like, what? where did all this even come from? But I'm just, girl, I'm really, I'm really just in my own world doing my own thing. And as I'm talking about it, that's why I love having this platform to where I'm able to just talk and I feel so much better. And I know that when this video is uploaded, maybe somebody will be able to like relate to it because I, I'm pretty sure we're always like, we're always, somebody's always, you know, worried about the future and I'm not saying you're not supposed to be worried about the future because that is important but what I want to say to y'all is and what I want to say to myself is we, we just got to live in a moment like relax 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 I have to tell myself to relax so many times because I'm just always on go like I'm just always like oh my god like what, what this that but, I, but and it's like hold up chill out relax Relax. But yesterday I was just like on 10. Like I was just, I was just on 10. And I'm just like, oh my God. Like what's going on? And I just kept trying to like, in my mind, I just kept trying to like tell myself like, this is the devil trying to play tricks with me. Like I'm good. Like I'm good. Like God got me. And that's, and that's one thing. Like I... I wish that when I was going through that season in my life, I felt how I feel now because I just, at any time I get like anxious or anytime I feel like something isn't going to work, I just always go back to the promise God made me. If you do your part, Chelsea, I'm going to do my part. And I just, that, that grounds me so much. Anytime I have like a an inkling of like fear or anxiety when it comes to this. I'm just like, God gave me this. God, God gave me this. So you have nothing to worry about, you know? Sometimes we can be doing things and it's not God sent. But this for sure, I know, was not my doing at all. I'm just, I don't know. But... That anxiousness has to go away. I'm not, that's not a way to live. That's not a way to feel. That's not my portion 
at all. So, yeah, that's just how I was feeling yesterday. And today, when I woke up, it was trying to creep up on me, but I, I started. I'm out. No, no, mm -mm. nope. Pick somebody else. Pick somebody else because I will not be the one today. No, 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 no. But let me finish my makeup. It is 11.23, so I got 30 minutes to get out of here. Still got to do my hair, put my outfit on, lotion up, do all the things. I will be back. I just got on a black tank top and some jeans. Simple. It's what we given. Don't worry about that <laughs> behind the mirror. For perfume, I put on the Baccarat Extract, or Extract. And I also put on some of this Nest Madagascar oil. Oh my god, Madagascar Vanilla. It smells so good together. That and that, chef's kiss. This is what my face looked like. Honestly, I've had better days, but I'm going to a coffee shop, right? It ain't that deep. <laughs> Shout out to Sebastian for remembering he can lay on the couch as long as he's on the cover. Y'all could probably barely see him because him in the cover is the same color. Look at that tail. Yeah, happy boy. I forgot I ordered these glasses off Amazon because I opened them in the car and never freaking took them out the car. But these are so cute. These are cute. We're going to keep them on. Uh, and our ETA is... Girl, every time I wear jeans and I'm in a car, we got to unbutton them because... Why not? But our ETA is 1228. All right, I just made it. I got a few text messages. Um, what did she send me? Hey girl, do you know what you went to the concert? I just ordered a cow girl hat. Huh. I be the back on the bitch. I walk in back for like Rick. So next door to the coffee shop, which I got me a um, matcha to go. And it's made with like rose water. It's definitely a different taste, but it's not bad. But, came to this sandwich shop that was next door and I think I'm gonna just get the classic club <laughs> okay do you know I know I'm gonna get the classic club <laughs> I've secured my Sephora bag you know we're at Trader Joe's getting things we don't need but hey live life we're gonna try out this Spanish rice this is what I originally came in here for. 106 and this car is crazy. Ooh, y'all. I gotta let these windows down for a second. Y'all know I came a, became a plant mom a few days ago. Got a water. Yeah, like it's gonna be an orange pepper. If you didn't watch that last vlog, this is Sam. And I'm his mommy. And I'm just trying to water him. I've seen you post the water when they get 50% dry. I don't know if I'm supposed to do this part, but I put some of his leaves too. All right, let's do a Trader Joe's haul. This is a new pickup for me, Spanish rice. Never had that. Smoked apple Chardonnay chicken sausage. Never had these, but if you're on TikTok, you know the girl with the chicken sausage and the cottage cheese and mustard. She made me want to try that. Everybody raves about how good this turkey bacon is, so we're going to give that a try. Trying out this barbecue teriyaki chicken. These are also new for me, the fiery chicken curry. Never had those. I haven't had this mandarin orange chicken in a long time, so I picked that up. This chicken tikka masala is a new pickup for me, so I'm excited to try this. Pineapple juice, I really like these. And last but not least, the only thing I actually went in there for is crunchy chili onion. Um, I've seen so many people talk about this, especially when it comes to eating it on the dumplings. And I just, I want to try it out, so... Yeah, because I've had those dumplings in my freezer for a while. And 
we're gonna try it out. I also got two um, eucalyptus for the showers. I can definitely see myself running through this refined lip gloss because I'm obsessed with the applicator. It feels so good on your lips like I'm obsessed. And please let me know if I'm the only one that be struggling with the eye patches. It's like every time I go to put them on, I forget how they go. I always put the, the big thick piece under here and then they don't be feeling right and I just be looking crazy. But I finally got them on right and we're done with our skincare. I am having just a slow, slow morning girl. It's 12.45. <laughs> and we in the house today. We're just going to do house stuff. I need to really just buckle down and get the rest of this stuff done. Now that my closet is built, we can really put everything that goes in that room, in that room, get it out of the room downstairs, and really just begin to get organized. Um, today, I'm gonna focus on organizing my makeup. It's really crazy because I've lived for months at this point using only the makeup in my makeup bag. So now that I got this, I got a big old box full of makeup, and I'm just like, what is this stuff? I haven't used this stuff in months. What is it? Like, why do I even need it? You know what I mean? So, I'm going to try to go through some of that stuff and minimize it down. Um, and then put it away because I don't have much storage at all. Uh, the only storage I really have is under the bathroom counter. So, I'm going to get some containers to try to put that stuff in. And yeah, hair stuff as well. So, Hair stuff and makeup stuff has to go under the counter in the bathroom. So that's what we're going to be working on today. Um, downstairs in like the common area, the kitchen, the living room, it needs to be spruced up. Dishes need to be washed. I need to fluff the couch. Those type of things. So we'll do that as well. But yeah, I just wanted to let you know what's going on. Yeah. Real quick, yesterday I did go to Sephora. I know, just went there in the last vlog. I can feel you judging me. I feel it. But it's all good. I was with my friend. We love to go to Sephora together, so we went. I'm just gonna show y'all some of the things I picked up. I picked up this Color Wow Extra Strength Dream Coat. This is supposed to be an anti-frizz treatment. I'm in my leave out era, so yeah, I'm gonna be trying that out. I also picked up the new Burberry Goddess. This smelled really, really good. And I wanted it. I got it in a 1.6 ounce. And this is like a warm, sweet type of scent. So if you're into that, you can blind by this. Because it, it smells really good. Like, it, it actually smells really, really good. I bought a lipstick. Who is she? I bought a Dior lipstick because I'm trying to find me just like a go-to lip. Usually I'll just wear like dark brown lip liner and clear gloss, but I want something a little bit more. So I bought this Dior lipstick in the color um, New Look 100. So obviously it's like a nudie color like a nudie color and I also bought a fancy gloss in the color fussy so I plan to do like dark brown lip liner with that lipstick and then this on top to see like what it looks like and then I got a concealer 
from Makeup Forever. This is the HD Skin Concealer. <laughs> I like the color of this, like the shade of it. I like that color. So I just wanted to try it out, you know. And then the last thing I got was from the Sephora brand. This is a matte powder foundation. And that's it, I think. Yeah. I think that's all I got. I'm saying I think that's all I got. Like, that wasn't hundreds of dollars, child. But, yeah, that's that. I'm about to. I'm kind of hungry, y'all. Last night, we had orange chicken from Trader Joe's. Because I also went to Trader Joe's. I showed y'all that stuff from Trader Joe's yesterday. But we had orange chicken and we had teriyaki chicken. It was so good. And before we came home, because I went to Home Goods too, <laughs> and TJ Maxx. I, I didn't get many things. I'm going to show y'all. I only got like some cups, a vase, simple stuff. Simple stuff. But before we came home, we went to, um, we stopped by like this. Um, it's called Extreme Teriyaki. It's like a hibachi place. And we got like some um, yum yum sauces. And we put it on top of the teriyaki chicken, the orange chicken. It was so good. So, hopefully, Dion ain't taking all the work because I want a little same, same. You know what I mean? I want a little same, same. And then, we're going to get started on organizing under these counters, getting all this stuff put up. Um, I think I started off this vlog. Why am I just sitting here? We can move. I was basically just saying, I think I started off this vlog, like, filling in um, the closet system. So, I'll show y'all what it looks like now, which... We've got a lot done. I don't know why the color is like that, but we've gotten a lot done. Still got a lot to do. And with these drawers, I did not even organize them. Girl, I just put all the stuff, like I put, like they're organized as far as like what's going to go in each drawer. But I sloppily just folded everything. So this drawer is underwear, bras, and sleep clothes this drawer is jean shorts joggers and like tops and um what are they called like sweatshirts and then this drawer right here is like athleisure two-piece sets stuff like that but yeah that's what's going on and I couldn't finish hanging up my clothes because I wanted to use this color hangers and I ran out. So I ordered some on Amazon. They're going to come tomorrow. And then so far, this is what like the purses and everything looks like. And I still got to finish the shoes down there. And then down there, I'm going to put my sneakers, which I only got like three or four pairs of sneakers. So that'll be perfect for that area. And then the mirror got brought up here, which I feel like y'all seen it. So if y'all seen this already, just disregard. Sorry. Yeah. But the mirror got brought up here, so yeah, that's what it's looking like. I'm very ha are y'all about to fall? I'm very happy and excited to just have this space of my own to be able to like create content, to just have a place to come chill in, um, and just 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 to have this place like I've always wanted, just like a room with all of my stuff in it. So I'm a very happy girl, and this room is just that. And then I'm going to have my office downstairs where I can, like, work at, feel motivated. You know, in my last apartment, my last place, I had both of these those rooms combined, and it just did not work. The room never stayed clean. I was never motivated. I never went in there because it was always a mess. So, yeah, I'm happy. I want to get, like, a, not, like, a full-on couch, but, like, a love seat or something. Right now, I have this chair in here, which... I would not recommend boucle furniture, white boucle furniture. It After a while, it just starts to look ashy and just not fresh anymore. And I don't like that. And with this chair specifically, it's like if you have like lotion on your arms or anything, you know, your, your arms are rubbing against the chair and it just starts to look dingy. And I don't like it, so... This is what the chair in the ottoman looks like. This came from Target probably like a year and a half, two years ago. Dion said he can clean it, but 
I'm just, I want, I want like a little love seat. Like, something like right here maybe. I don't know. Why did I eat and now I want to take a nap? Like, I want to take a little nappy nap. But we're not. I'll show y'all what I got from the store yesterday. Starting with, the, like, come on. This is so freaking cute. Like... Are you kidding me? It was $4.99. Like, so cute. I also bought the ones that I drunk my coffee out of this morning. Because these were so cute. Um, so a little coffee still in that chair. But, I'm trying to show y'all. This is what it looks like. And it has like the gold trimming. Like, so cute. And then I just bought these gold measuring cups. You know, just like simple. And then, okay, this was one of those purchases that's like, girl, be for real. But I was being for real. How cute. It's a ghost. It's a little ghost. I just thought this was so cute and obviously I'm not gonna use this right now, but when the time is right, it's gonna be such a vibe and it's by DW Home and it's vanilla cupcake. And it smells like really sweet, but not too, too, too sweet. And it's just the cutest thing I've ever seen. Like, hold on. Like, come on, how freaking cute. So, pick this up. Oh, and the last thing I picked up was this vase. Looks like this. Super cute. This is only $16.99 and it has so much like texture to it. Super cute. And yeah, that's what I picked up yesterday, you guys. Um, Now we're going to go upstairs and we're going to sort through this makeup and we're going to get it done. I don't think I showed y'all this top drawer, which it is. I got this drawer for um like my jewelry and stuff. But I'm also gonna put sunglasses in here, so I'm actually gonna take like these three up because I don't have that much jewelry. So yeah, I'm gonna leave this with jewelry, and then I'm gonna put sunglasses over here. So this is what it's looking like so this is what it's looking like so far I have more jewelry I just have to continue to unpack and I can continue to just like spread it out but this makes me so happy and I just feel like the getting ready process is just gonna be so easy like I can just uh, I need this 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 like yeah I'm a happy girl like I'm a I'm a very happy girl right now. All right, y'all. This is most of the makeup. I just like I just can't get it through my head. Like, don't get. Why do I need this? Like, I've literally only used the same products for so long. But obviously, I want my stuff and I want to play in makeup again and try different stuff. But it's just like. Mm. So we finna go through this stuff. I'm going to make a keep pal and a not keep pal. Which, when I put all this stuff in this box, I already did that. So we're gonna see if I wanna get rid of anything, but I don't think I do, so. Let's begin.
All right, so I organized everything. So we have primers right there, foundations, concealers, blush, lip products, um, eyebrow stuff, setting powders, beauty blenders, brushes, and setting sprays. Y'all, I've never used this. I just bought this because Jackie Ina, black, <laughs> support a black collaboration. And I never threw it away because it's really pretty. But I don't wear eyeshadow. So, yeah. That's that. I gotta find somewhere to put all this stuff at. But everything here. Well, I gotta go through the lip products. I know I'm gonna get some, rid of some of those like MAC lipsticks and stuff. But mostly everything here I'm keeping. And that was like everything that was in the box. So, we gotta find somewhere to put this stuff. Y'all know this console thing was downstairs. I decided to bring it up here because I really needed extra storage. And this worked out perfectly. So I had to get something else for downstairs or either get the same one. And all of those containers are my makeup. I sorted them out from concealers to setting powders and whatever, whatever. This is my little junk. It got a bunch of stuff in perfume, beauty blenders, lip glosses, makeup cleaners, stuff like that. These are my dossier perfumes. And yeah, that's that. All the stuff I don't want to be shown. And close it up. And then in my last apartment, this picture was above our bed. I'm going to put that picture up now. And I'm going to be able to put cutesy stuff up here. So let's hang this picture up. All right, y'all, so we are about to, I guess I need to see how high I want it. Mm. Maybe like right here. I don't know. 
I'm just gonna I forgot how high that was. Put it back. I'm gonna just put it right here. Let me see. Move, Sebastian. I'm gonna just put it right here. How do I look? Huh? I think it's in the middle. Yeah, tap it. Hey, it's giving I N D E P. I told you, motherfucker, do it at an angle. E N T E N T. Hold on, y'all. Is this cute with the little stand under it? The picture is definitely like kind of bigger than the stand, but I'm not mad at it. And I'm about to sit my lady over here. How cute is she? She's from CB2. That's cute. Oh, good morning, y'all. I'm so just annoyed right now. I'm sure y'all have been hearing me say like throughout my vlogs like I still don't have internet in this house and it's because the builders who built the house is something called a condo wood. They didn't connect them all the way to the ground through the garage so I've had several like AT&T people come out and like try to make it work but it's just not working so I've contacted like the people my management people from the house and they've contacted the homeowners and it's just a disconnect right there like the people that built the house they have the warranty through they're not coming out to fix the problem I do not know why and I've seen like I'm cc'd on all the emails I see the back and forth the people are being so rude they just aren't coming out to do their job which leads me not being able to do my job and it's just so frustrating like I don't even care about like I just feel like I just feel like I haven't been able to get like comfortable in this home the TVs aren't mounted up nothing because there's no internet a house with no internet is not a house it's 2023 nothing works without internet you know what I mean and besides all of that I'm not able to do my job every single upload y'all see is for me going to sit at a public place for hours trying to get the videos uploaded like hours and I got a comment this morning and it just really 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 made me just want to cry I did cry because it really hurt my feelings because I know how hard I'm trying and it's just she was just and I don't even think she meant it to be like rude or whatever but she, basically she was just like um we're, I'm tired of hearing the same music or something like that. And it's like, I'm tired of putting the same music, but it already take me hours to upload. I can't sit in these public places for hours looking for music, uploading videos. Like, I still have other stuff to do. And it's just like, I'm so just annoyed. I'm so annoyed. I'm so, And it's just like, I'm at a point where there's nothing I can do. And the people who my management from the the house is like they're frustrated because they're trying to do their part and it's just like it's a disconnect so the person who's here today I had another person come today because I contacted my people again I'm like hey any updates on the internet he was like oh they told me they fixed it this was a couple of days ago they was like he was like they told me they fixed it so you could call somebody else out to you know finally get internet so I made an appointment for today the man out here he's like it's not working so I let him talk to him so he can explain to him exactly So he can explain to him exactly what's going on. And it's just like everybody's frustrated in this situation because the warranty people aren't coming out to do their job. And I just don't understand why. And it's like out of all of these townhouses, me 
isn't that so crazy out of all of these townhouses out here the only one that have an issue is mine oh my god it's so frustrating like i don't know so if y'all tired of hearing the same music or whatever the case may be just know on my part i'm trying like i really am trying like and it's like I don't know. I don't take, and which I know everybody should, but I just don't take like criticism well, like especially when it comes to my job. Because although I know I can be better, I can do things better. We can all do better. It's like <laughs> I'm sensitive about my shit. You know what I mean? So please, just just bear with me because. I've been living in a house with no internet, like, literally, like, phone moving slow. And then, like, I'm so used to, like, having, like, a house with internet, like, Alexa's going, iPads, TVs. We've only had our phone. So, y'all know, um, well, whatever. I took a shower last night. Yesterday, I had my body on all day, like, did not take it off. Until I took a shower because I hate when my body get wet in the shower. So I'm in the shower. I took a good shower too. Like I was getting in there. I used extra products. Like I was really doing my big one. Why do I get out the shower? Why do I get out the shower and I like scratch my head and I feel the braids? Girl, the whole quick weave came off. One piece. I could not believe it. It's right here on the floor. The whole entire thing. The whole thing just came off. I was like, um, okay. Oh, okay, so this is what we look like. Hey y'all, good morning. Happy, um, what is today? Wednesday, it's August 16th. I started this vlog, I don't even know when, but it's been like four days or five days. It's been some time since y'all last seen me. Last time y'all seen me, girl, I was sad about the internet. Um, my hair hadn't came off, obviously I've done my hair, and I'm not that sad anymore. Um, that same day, I wanna say, yeah, that same day, I ended up finally receiving a call um, from the people saying they were going to come out and look and see what's going on because they had said they did it already. I don't know if I added that part, but they said they did it, which was a lie. That's why I called the internet people to come back out. So whatever. Somebody actually came today for real and he, y'all, I'm just a girl. Like I am just a girl. I don't know what's going on down there. Like, I don't know the terms and what everything's called, but he ended up having to cut the sheetrock to look for the piece that they needed. He ended up finding it. So I made another appointment for internet people to come out. So on Friday, they're supposed to come out and Lord, please let everything work. So yeah, that's what we're at with that. We're still working on a room. Um, it was clean and then I started another vlog and started getting ready because I went to Beyonce, which y'all will see that in another vlog. So I have to straighten up the room again, but I'm hungry. So we about to eat. I think I'm gonna just do whatever in the freezer, honestly. Hopefully it's some waffles in there. Hopefully it's some waffles in there. And girl, 11 years later, I've started watching Scandal. I've always watched the first episode and never watched anymore. And I don't know why, because the first episode is really good. Like if you're into that type of suspense type of, you know that. You, if you watch Scandal, then you know, like I love Shonda Rhimes, love How to Get Away with Murder. So I just don't understand why it's taking me 11 years to watch this show, but I'm hooked. So I'm so excited to hopefully, preferably be, no, I'm about that. To be getting internet on Friday so we can put the TVs up and I can just binge this weekend on the couch. Like, that sounds like such a great weekend, doesn't it? Yeah. So, yeah, let's see what we got in here to eat, girl. Because I am hungry. Alright. Sausage. And 
some waffles. That's what it's gonna be. I need to get the air fryer out. Bum 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 All right, while the sausage is cooked, we're about to take our vitamins, girl. Why did I forget to take my vitamins yesterday? And I felt like a failure because I haven't missed a day since I dedicated myself to taking my iron pills and this B12. I've taken it every single day. I was just dumping myself yesterday. I said, oh. No, I didn't. Like, I like ice with my orange juice. Cause I like it cold. Cold, cold, cold. Orange juice is so expensive, y'all. Like, oh my goodness. But I really enjoy like having orange juice, so yeah. But it's expensive. I'm gonna get one of my little pink disposable straws from Amazon. Vitamins. I swear by these things. Like, I don't care what nobody say. Like, I've been prescribed iron pills from the hospital, from the doctor. From several people. These is the best ones, honey. These these is the best ones. Like I just asked on my home decor page, should let me see what they're saying. I said, should I add a picture light above the picture? Seventy three percent of people said yes. Twenty seven percent of the people said no. But it's only been up for seven minutes. So this is the area right here. Um. So this is the area. We got the cabinet, which is a storage cabinet that got all the junk in it. Y'all know that picture. And then picture light would be above. I think it'll be a vibe like at nighttime, you know? Like if you don't want to turn on the light, if you don't want to turn on the lamp, you can have the picture light. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna do it. What do y'all think? So that's I'm trying to give y'all the area so y'all can see. And if y'all into home decor, if y'all into home decor, y'all should follow my um, home decor Instagram page because I feel like I'm more active there because the platform is smaller. I'm able to actually, you know, like talk to y'all and ask y'all questions that I want to ask um, before the vlog comes out because this vlog won't be out until Sunday and today is... Wednesday and I want to know whether or not I should buy a picture light and I have two picture lights I just got to go down in that garage to find them maybe Deanna but yeah and then if I do do a picture light if I do do a picture light I think I'm gonna do a gold one because the mirror is gold it's gold accents I think I'm gonna do a gold one so <sighs> We'll see. But I'm 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 thinking that'll be like a little vibe. Also, I had to reorder the freaking hangers because these talking about some of your package may be lost. I ordered these so August 10th. Today's August 16th. Amazon Prime be like next day, so they say these are gonna come tomorrow. Hopefully they actually come so I can fix the because girl right now It's just those clothes over there was clothes that came out the washing machine that just needed to dry So we just set them right there. These are random clothes right here. That's just being random But I want to be able to you know fix it up, but I need the hangers. I want cohesive hangers, so Hopefully they come tomorrow. I'm annoying myself by how I was holding the camera crooked but hopefully they come tomorrow so we can fill that in and have a complete little look. Also, now that I put the sunglasses in here, I want to show y'all like what it looks like. Girl, she done got crowded because I done actually found my stuff. As you can see, I got more stuff than I thought I had. And this is after I went through everything, but everything's mostly organized. I cannot wait to wear these earrings. I got these from Zara. Oh, they're so cute. 
cute these two but this is just um necklaces and just random stuff and these are my sunglasses i don't have a lot because i don't really wear sunglasses like that but the ones i have are right here these are my favorite these gucci ones and then these chanel ones are my favorite but this is what this looks like everything has a spot everything is organized i could just come in grab what i want and i've actually been putting stuff back so go me this looks so good like that looks so good and once again these are from amazon you could just remove them and um these things are removable too so these actually had i threw them away so y'all won't be able to see but let me show y'all y'all see that you could take it out and it could be just open like that if you want so very versatile love that yeah that's that this is probably my favorite drawing girl i lost this earring had to be two years ago and i'm still holding on to this one because i just can't let it go i really can't <laughs> so maybe one day i lost these two these dior earrings i lost one of those and i lost one of these what a waste of money look what was just delivered I actually requested the replacement today, this morning, and it's here, so let's go hang some stuff up. We got a lot of clothes on the hanging racks, which I wanted because these are the clothes I actually wear. <sighs> God, that was a lot. <laughs> but we got the clothes, we got our jeans. I do not have a lot of jeans. Once upon a time ago, I did have a lot of jeans, but I only kept the jeans that look good on me. So we're down to one, two, three, four, five, five pair. But yeah, um. Let me scoot back. I really like the way it looks as of now. It's very um, practical. Like, it's not just cute. This is functional for me. Like, this makes me happy. Very happy. Because I can get my stuff as I need it, put it back, you know. Eventually, I'm probably going to try to find a better system for these perfumes. But for now, this is where they live. And then I got some of my niche fragrances right here. I definitely want to find something for them to go on right here. Because I don't know what my issue is. But I do not like stuff just sitting on the regular. Just I like it sitting on something like a tray or something. But that's that right now. I'm just so happy. I'm like patiently, impatiently waiting for the sun to go down so I can just sit in here and look and I did find the gold um picture light so Dion took Sebastian to the dog park but when they get back he's gonna put it up and I'm excited to see how it looks and this is me this is how I've been looking all day a mess a freaking mess <sighs> I'm about to take a shower though it get cozy Fresh out the shower. Shower was so good. I showed y'all what I used because I wanted to. <laughs> I've been loving that Loom or Lumi, however you say it. Love, love, love that. My bottle is damn near empty. I got one more bottle in my other bathroom, but it's so good, y'all. It's really good. And then, of course, the Tree Hut, their body wash is so good. If you love a good lather, like something that's going to give you a lot of suds, I love stuff like that. 
Definitely get the body wash. My favorite scent is the Moroccan Rose. In everything Tree Hut makes, I'm absolutely obsessed with Moroccan Rose. If you have a nose and it works, then you know that's the best scent. It smells so good. <clears throat> but I'm about to do my skincare and then after that, I'm not going to show you my skincare. Because I mean, how many times do you want to see it? I'm washing my face, moisturizer, um, yeah, not, nothing special. But after that, I need to wash my brushes because... Tomorrow, I decided I want to record a chit chat get ready with me. I haven't done one in so long, so I decided I want to record a chit chat get ready with me, and I'll put that up on Friday. Tomorrow's Thursday. Mm -hmm. So I'll put that up on Friday, and then Sunday will be the vlog. This vlog. So happy Sunday, y'all, by the way, if you're watching this on Sunday. So once again, I'm about to do my skincare, and I will be back so we can wash our brushes. I don't know if I'm going to wash all my brushes. I might just wash the ones I'll be using and a few beauty blenders because my beauty blenders are all dirty. I just thought of a fun video idea. <laughs> I'm so excited because I just think that it's going to be so fun for me to record and I think you guys will like it as well. So I'm actually going to record that tomorrow too. So I'm going to do the chit chat get ready with me first. Because obviously I need my makeup done for the other video. So I'm going to do the chit chat get ready with me first. And then I'm going to record that video. And I'm not going to tell y'all what it is. You just have to keep watching. Hey. This nigga. Th this what men do. This nigga just. The candle was over there. I'd rather you blow it out than sit it next to my $10,000 purse. Come on. The purse, God forbid, catch on fire and then what? Boy, don't, don't let these people see you get it. <laughs> and get out of here, man. What you doing? Need to put it up. I'm about to clean my makeup oh. brushes. That's why I'm in here. All right. Bro, don't be eating the candy tubs. It's not funny. See, I seen that dog. I got to get one. What's up, Sebastian? You can't. Why is he sitting like that? That leg is wide. What is happening right now, man? Like. Doing? Hold on, let me turn the lights off. Y'all not getting a true vibe. What? The mirror cricket. What's cricket? Oh, that. Oh, <gasps> Dio! Hey, you know I always told you, you put a nail up. Bro, there. you trying to blame me, bro? bro? You put a nail up there, bro. A nail not gonna work. It worked. Don't touch it. Bro, I don't have to put a screw up there, bro. <laughs> no, just sit my picture back up there. It's not gonna work, Dion. Yes, it will. Look at the nails; they ought to come down. It's not gonna work. You can sit it up there. Okay, well, fix it now. Yeah, we're gonna have to... This is a disaster. I tried to I show y'all. Turn some lights on, <laughs> man. Bro, we, I told you, we have to get so big for this. I'm going to let him figure that out, but I'm about to clean these brushes. This is all I can find. This is really good, but it stinks. And this is for daily brush cleaner. Both of these are supposed to be for like, you know, a quick clean. I need a deep clean, but we're just going to go with it. All right, y'all. Everything's back up. The light is bright, so you really can't see what it's giving, but it looks, it looks really good. I like it. And just in case you guys were wondering about this, she's from CB2. I'll have her link. And then this thing was from Target. And I like how they're both like that paper mache type of material, but both still very heavy. And then Tom Ford book Amazon. Can't even make my freaking bed because <laughs> somebody is still asleep. Excuse me. Excuse me. 
Excuse me. Hello. Psst. Psst. <laughs> what time you getting up? Guess he's not ready to get up. I'm going downstairs. I don't know if I showed y'all, but y'all know I had those like little lemon things in the vase. And so many people ask me if those are real. They're not. I got them from Hobby Lobby. But I switched it for a little olive branch. Because I'm annoying. <laughs> So you come from the bed to the couch. Uh, I'm just so amazed. I'm about to record my chit chat. Get ready with me. So I was just letting y'all know that I'll be back. Um, trying to get all my stuff together. I need to get my, my ring light. In my old place, I used to have this stuff sitting out all the time, but not anymore because I want to be able to enjoy my place without equipment being everywhere. You know what I mean? So, I'll be putting it up. But yeah, I will... Um, I'll be back when y'all see me. We're gonna be beat face shawty, period. And I'm recording two videos today. So, I'm gonna be a little busy, period. When I tell you, I am so hungry. It's 2.34. I just finished recording the first video. I gotta get me a little snack or something. I am hungry. Hello? Hey. Yeah, you said the pizza was in the oven, so that means I can have it. Yeah. What you gonna eat? I will never understand how the girls be recording three, four, five, six, seven YouTube videos in one day. I'm ready to take this makeup off and be done. <laughs> like. But I'm going to do the second video. I am going to take a little break though. I just ate. So I'm going to, you know, chill out for a little bit. And then we're going to get to it. But, baby, I think two might be my tops. Because, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It turned out good. It's cute. All right, just got dressed for the second video. My makeup looks so... Good. Mm -hmm. Don't play with her. Anyways, I got on this like turtleneck type of shirt, but it's so stretchy. Got it from H&M. Go figure. And these earrings. I've been wanting to wear these, and they're so cute. So yeah, we're about to record. Okay. I look good. I need to go ahead while I look this good. I need to go take that picture I need to take. Might just do that. But let me record. Let me record. And um I, I can't stop. I gotta stop looking at myself. But yeah, let me go ahead and record and um I'll be back. Whew, y'all. I recorded my two videos and I want to take a picture. I um 
I need to take a picture. But I also do want to take the picture because my makeup look good. Why not? Why not just go ahead and get out of the way? I'm not like um exhausted. I actually feel like I got some energy. It's weird. Let me scoot y'all back some. But my only thing is, I know for my picture, I want a coffee in my hand. Like a little matcha or something. Because it is going to go with the picture. Because I'm trying to give. I, in my head, in my head, I know how it, I know how it looks. I just need to figure out where I'm going to take this picture. I just need a plain wall or something. That's all I need. I'm going to figure it out. But um, I would just put the clothes on and get ready to go. But Dion is downstairs getting his car fixed. So I have to wait for him to finish getting his car fixed. And then I'll be able to take the pick pick. But I'm just having a good day. I've been so productive today. Um... And pr productivity doesn't mean you have to wake up extremely early and get started as soon as you wake up. I'm not like that. I need some time to myself. I'm not trying to wake up and get straight to the work. I need to. So if I was if I was the type of person that had to like go into a job or even if I worked like remotely for like a call center or something like that, I would have to train myself to wake up a little bit ahead of time because I enjoy those moments of just like laying in the bed doing nothing on your phone just your, a little bit of me time like me time is so essential to me so yeah um i feel good and it's still it's 4 50 it's 4 50 the sun is out it's shining bright i'm gonna go ahead and take this picture and then i'm gonna be done for today so i recorded a video that i'm gonna upload tomorrow so when i get in the bed tonight i'm gonna edit that video and Tomorrow is supposed to be the day we get internet, y'all. Not supposed to be. Tomorrow is the day we get internet. So, I'm not going to have to go nowhere. I can upload my video at my house. And um, I got a video for next week, too. The one I just recorded. So, I feel good about myself. I feel really, really good. I want to keep this momentum going. I need to think of some more video ideas. So, while I'm in these good moods, I can just record and record and record. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I'm about to just chill out um, until his car get done and we can leave. I need to see if that outfit needs to be steamed because it is like a linen outfit. So I need to check on that. So here's the outfit. I love it. I love the pants. I love flowy pants. They're long enough. And then here's the top. I just put like this black bandeau under it because I don't like the way the top look when it's closed up that don't give nothing to me so we're gonna open it up i think this is cute i ain't got a clue bro this one's cute i'm back home i'm tired y'all like let's wrap this up <laughs> Let me just show y'all what I got real quick. I'm making some blueberry muffins, but that's in another vlog. But I needed a muffin pan. So I picked that one up. I also picked up these Alani um, drinks. The ones, um, the Kim K ones. First of all, the pink packaging. Every time I see somebody post these, I'm just like, I want this so bad because it's so cute. I picked up two. I was going to pick up four. But I picked up two because I'm like, let me try it. I've heard so many mixed reviews. They're good. They're bad. They're okay. Whatever. So I picked up two um, to try those out. And then the last things I got were these tanks. I've told y'all about these tanks before. I only have the black and white today. I decided to pick up some colors. I got this um, olive green one y'all these tanks are so good i love how they're like high on the neck they just fit so good they're so comfortable and they're only eight dollars they're from the brand a new day i'll have them linked down below but i picked up this olive green one girl i picked up a purple i'm not even a purple type of girl but this eggplant purple was speaking to me so i got this purple one mm. I don't know what color I would say this is. What color would y'all say this is? Does it say? It says 10. 
So this tan one. And then the last one I got was this green color one. With this green. And I just love these. This makes for a quick outfit. You could throw on some jeans. You could throw on some trousers. You could throw on some joggers, some shorts, whatever the case may be, and get your little outfit going. Oh, and I got some baking cups. For the muffin, I'm about to go take a shower, take this makeup off, and I'll see y'all tomorrow because tomorrow we get in internet, and I'm so excited. Like, through the roof excited so i'll be back tomorrow um girl let me oh that feels so good these lashes Phew. do y'all see that alexa play drake so sexy it hurts i'm so excited y'all look at the tv we have internet. It's so exciting. Y'all, I'm so excited. Like, I'm so excited to have internet. It's been so long. I look, look a little crazy. But I'm so excited. I'm so happy. <sighs> we plug the Alexa up. We plug the TVs up. The iPads. The phones. Everything. Ugh. I'm so Excited! But no, dead serious, I'm very, very excited. But Dion is rushing me. We're about to go to IKEA and get all day long. We've been in the house all day long because the man took like five hours to hook up the internet. He came at twelve forty. I don't know what. I don't know what took so long, but I don't even care because, baby, I got internet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Tell that. I thought that man about to take 30 minutes. I thought, I thought it was going to be quick, too. Man. But I'm about to put some lotion on, and we're going to run out and go to Ikea because I want to get some shelves for my bathroom. I'll show y'all before we leave what I'm trying to do. So above the toilet right there, I want to put some shelves. Because every time I do my makeup, this is from yesterday when I had my long little day chair of recording. And doing my makeup, but I want to be able to just sit my stuff I use all the time right up there. Today's OOTD, these joggers are from Fashion Nova. Absolutely love them. And then this is one of these those tanks I was telling you about from Amazon. This is a black one. Mm -mm -mm. Bye. Um, you can't bam it into the mirror? Okay, well try, let me see how it look up there. I don't like that. That was an epic fail, y'all. He put it up and I hated it, so now we got holes in the wall that we have to patch up. And I'm annoyed. I'm, I'm very annoyed because, first of all, I wanted it over there anyways and it was too long, but that's my fault for not measuring. Hey y'all, sorry for not properly closing off the vlog, but I want to say happy Sunday. Thank you so much for watching if you made it to the end, and even if you didn't make it to the end. Well, if you didn't make it to the end, you wouldn't be hearing this. But, thank you so much for watching. There'll be so many more videos coming. I have been vlogging so much, so just stay tuned. And if you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and if you're not subscribed, subscribe. Again, I love y'all so much, and I hope y'all have a wonderful week.